All right, so I saw one of these uh, or similar one when I was playing pickleball and I thought it was pretty cool. You're probably wondering what it is. Um, but yeah, I got this on Amazon and basically here you can see, um, but it's like a chair, stool, table kind of thing. And yeah, it's very nice and compact and easy to use. So let me show you this. They actually have the instructions here. But basically you have to twist it and then you can open it. And I'll show you kind of close up how it works and then I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so they have this where it says like off and on. Uh, let me actually zoom out. And basically when it's off, when you pull it kind of holds together. But when you twist it slightly, it's like barely twist, then it opens up. And you want to like keep twisting it as you pull. And you can see these sections kind of lock in right there. Okay, and then you have this stool. It's kind of nice because you can also adjust like how high you want it. You don't have to like release it completely. So here you can see now you have a smaller one. Okay, and you can change the height. All right, and there's a spring in it. So you can see like it kind of goes on its own. The only thing is you want to make sure that these actually locked in place. Right now you can see these ones aren't really locked in, but it's locked in down there. Okay, so when you do that, because otherwise it can twist and collapse. So you want to make sure when you twist it that these little clips engage all the way because if they don't, sometimes it might be partially engaged and then you might sit on it and it might like collapse. So you want to make sure with that, okay? So either way, you just open it up. You can kind of test it by hitting it a little. And this thing says it's rated for up to 400 pounds. You can see I can sit on it. Okay, no problem. Um, it does wobble a little, but it's pretty sturdy. And obviously if you um, lower it some so that the um, taller ones aren't, okay, let's say we put it like this, so it's more like a little round stumpy stool, okay, then obviously it's gonna be a bit more stable like that. Um, but yeah, the only thing with this is it's, so these are just plastic here. It doesn't have rubber feet. Um, but the only thing is because it's just a flat thing like this, you can only use this on flat surfaces. If it's kind of like bumpy and crooked, then this thing won't sit properly. So keep that in mind. This is meant for flat surfaces only. All right, but yeah, it works well. And if you get like multiple, you can kind of use one as a tabletop and one as like a stool. So let me show you that real quick. Let me go grab another one. Okay, so let's say you don't want to sit on the ground. You got that. You can take this one. I mean, technically, you don't even need to open it, but you can open it, like, partially. Okay, so it's, like, a short one like this. And then you have, like, a little stool and a table here. And you can just sit there and use it as a table. Then you can, like, play cards or whatever. I mean, it's not really a big surface for playing cards. They do have some where they have, like, a larger, wide-open surface. But then if you end up sitting like on the part that's sticking out, <laughs> it'll probably tip over. So keep that in mind. And also those ones cost a lot more. So this is pretty cool. Neat idea, small, compact, not too heavy. I think they're saying like one of these is about two pounds or something, two point something pounds. Um, I don't have a good scale to weigh it, um, to weigh it that accurately. But uh, yeah, um, depending on what you think is light or heavy, um, this is more like not for I wouldn't bring this around for like hiking but if you're going like camping and you have a flat surface usually camping maybe not you might have to make a flat surface for this um, but I would use this more for like some events I use it at pickleball because the courts are completely flat and smooth um, so yeah um, think about what kind of situation this would be useful for because it won't be useful for every situation so keep that in mind um, and yeah, uh, as for the price, um, this one was a two pack. Um, I have like some Amazon business pricing. So for me, it was like 33 plus tax. I think if you buy this, it's probably 35 or 40 plus tax for two. So about 20, 15 to $20 per. If you buy a whole bunch of them, you get even cheaper. Um, but you'd have to buy a lot. So <laughs> keep that in mind. Anyways, that's pretty much it for now. Thanks for watching and hopefully you enjoy this and find them useful, and I'll see you all in the next one. All right, bye.